right, so I'm very excited today because I am building a PC, my very first one. So this is, I'll put a list of all the things that I got in the description. And the only thing I've done so far, since I don't really have a lot of stuff here yet, they're all arriving tonight, is I added a fan. It comes with two fans automatically. Then I just added another one because somebody told me that I should have like two intakes and then one outtake. So that's what I did. Uh, and yeah, I'm excited to build the rest of the PC. And I hope you enjoy watching me screw up. Now let's get started. I'm excited. I didn't want to wait. Okay, so first off, GPU. I got the coveted RTX 3070 Ti. It's the Fractal Meshify C. Here's my RAM. It is a Corsair Vengeance, whatever the f I don't, I don't know. I got like a one terabyte SSD. And like my desk, I have fractal paintings that I made. And so the fractal design, I don't know if you, okay, you can tell. See, they match. Um, I got a Ryzen 5, because this comes with its own heat sink thingy. Now the motherboard. I got the this thingy. I don't know how I got this recommendation. I was just watching a bunch of videos and book bookmark things, and this was the cheapest, I think. So I got it. This ginormous power supply. So, I've been watching a ton of videos on how to build a PC. And so let's see if my knowledge will come into play now. So here is the motherboard. The standoff, I think, for the NVMe. The IO shield. I know these words. My word. Get out. Get out. Why are you stuck? Okay. Motherboard is free. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. First things first. CPU. And the Ryzen 5. 5, 5600X or whatever. Okay, I can do this properly. So I, I, I unhinge it, right? I, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. Oof. Okay. Quick inspection of all the pins. Nothing seems to be out of place. Uh, triangle to triangle. Triangle to triangle. All of them are triangles, but which one's the square? It doesn't have a thingy. Okay, that one has a thingy. I think it's supposed to be this way. Okay, I just drop it in gently. If I have to push it in, then it doesn't work. Okay, and then do I, do I like close it now? I'm scared. I think I did it. I don't know. Okay, so here's the heat thingy. Uh, do I have to rip? Why did I just touch that? Maybe I should have watched on, uh, one last time, you know? Okay, so you do take it out. Then... Okay. Alright, I got it. Okay, CPU fan. That makes sense. It's a CPU and it's its fan. So it should go on the CPU fan. Okay. Okay. Woohoo! I got it. Okay, CPU is in. What was next? Water. You have it set to M for medium, when it should be W for Wombo. Next one is RAM. Okay, like that. Like that, 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 that. Digibop, digibop. And you just push and push and push and just push. Okay. It's gonna be too hard for me. I push a lot of things in. Okay, I know it's supposed to be like the easiest part, but why does it feel like I gotta put a lot of fours on it? Okay, so that snapped. Two and four, we're good. Here it is, it's very tiny to take off the heat sink off of this. Bro, I have no idea what a Phillips screw is. That in there. And then put it back. And then press down on it. And then put the little thingy. Okay. 
and screwing in the SSD. Okay, we got the computer, the heat, the heater fan, the RAMs, and the SSD in. Motherboard standoffs, or whatever they're called. Oh, IO Shield. Um, don't know how to do this. It's not gonna work, Johan. We got there. The IO Shield was not completely in yet, so I gotta take you off for now. There. We go. Okay. I think it's all the way in on all four sides. Alright. Let's put the motherboard in again. Okay, line that up with the IO. Line up those standoffs. Okay, standoffs. Motherboard is secured, IO shield is done, blah 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 blah. Next up, I think we add the, we try to finagle with the cords because we can do the GPU last. Okay, so I'm going to try and bring it up, hopefully nothing crashes. And we're goody, look at that. It, it has been kind of like less stressful than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be a lot more like I'll be crying, I'll be screaming, I'll be... So we have the USB 3.0. Finally let me on the side. And I do it on top. And it comes out like this. Look, little blue dongle. Okay. And then I snap it in this way. Somebody said to be careful about this because you can bend the pins. So I'm going to be careful. And I think it's in. Okay. And then I just... Next one, all these tiny ones, the power, the HLD, the reset, these are all supposed to go in that corner. So, there you go. So let's see, I think they explain it somewhere, number 16. Where is the power? That's HD, the, the power LED, okay. So here's the power LED. So tiny, my word. I need the positive on the most left side and then the negative on the one right next to it. On the way in. You think I got that? Yeah, okay. It's so tiny. Oh. Power switch, reset switch. So power is on the top right next to the thing. And how do I know which direction it's supposed to go in? I guess labels on top. Okay, so all of that is in HD audio. Maybe that actually had to go in there. Okay, so it's going on the right side. So I need to loop it down here. Okay, so that's in. So I have three fans. I have the one here, I have one here, and then I have one in the back. They didn't give me enough space. I could take off the, the shroud. And I think I'll do that. I don't want to. I don't want to push. I don't want to pull too hard. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna take out that shroud because it's in the way. Thank you. Okay, so that gives me room. Okay. Then last fan goes right. Right. Goes right there. So all the I.O. thingy has been plugged in, all the fans have been plugged in, and PSU time. And I have the 750 gold 80 plus, I don't know, EVGA. I have, that. I have this monstrosity. I've been here for an hour? You're kidding me. Now we're gonna focus on the PSU. Oh, fuck! Well, it's in its box, and there's like foam. Okay, there is foam. 
So they accounted for that, in case you're stupid like me. I don't know what this is. I, oh, these, these are for cable management. This is to plug it into the actual outlet. And a whole bunch of cords. So I think the consensus is to plug stuff in and then install it inside the PC, the, the case. So I think that's, that's kind of what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna plug everything in and then just snug it in at the end. So CPU one first. It doesn't make a difference as I'm supposed to use. Oh, the one with, okay, got it. It's very foolproof, I like that. So there's two ends to the CPU and I was like, which one is supposed to be the one I, I plug in? But in the back of the power supply, it'll only accept the one that has a one prong. So that one plugs in. How are we gonna finagle you to go into that power? And then, voila, okay. So that's in, where's the snap? I need to hear the snap. Well, I'm trying to pull it out, it's not doing anything. So I think it's in. That into the grommet. So I think all power things are done. I can now just snugly try and fit this in. Does it go from the front? Because I've seen other people just slide it into the side, but I guess we might have to do it from the back. So I need to unplug these things. The, the shroud that I took off to like give more room for my cords is exactly what this is for, for me to actually access the power supply. To the, to the best of my knowledge, the powers have been powered. Now we just screw the power supply on. Voila. Now we just tighten the screws. I, I, I got the, this one if you need the reminder. There it is. It's in like a nice like slanted box too. They're like very, they're very high tech. That one and that one off. Oops. We built it! I got the last thing in. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Ooh, I almost freaked out. Can we do it for a long time? Can we do it for the whole thing? Ooh. Ah. The cable management in the back is also not too bad. Why? Okay. Um, say, this bad boy. Look at that. I have built a PC. Now I'm gonna put it on the table here. All right, so it's been a long and arduous journey. I'm about to do the first turn on. Uh, then we turn this on, then I gotta press delete repeatedly. That's right. Ooh, fans are running. Look, the RGB stuff. That's cool. I'm pressing delete as fast as I can. Okay, so the light changed. Ooh, ooh, what's this? Uh, new CP install, please enter setup to configure this your system. Press F1 to run setup. F1. Whoa! Okay, we're in! I got it! I'm gonna go watch a video on what to do when you first turn on your thingy. I look like a mess, but it's turning on, it's set up, well, it's installing Windows, and once that's done, I can finally do work on it. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching my first time building a PC. It took a lot of work, a lot of time, a lot of energy to get all the parts together to decide which parts to use. This video is actually edited on this new PC, so I'm really happy because it's so powerful. You have no idea how much better it is to edit on a more powerful computer than a laptop, and I love it. Uh, so until next time, the semester's about to start. Uh, I don't know if I can put out a video before then, but yeah, I'll see y'all next time.